you know, next we are talking about what are the carcinoid uh, syndrome or carcinoid tumors, you know. So the carcinoid tumors are rare tumors uh, that develop from hormone producing cells called uh, enterochromaffin cells, you know, uh, and that occur throughout the body. Uh, so with approximately 65% originating in the gastrointestinal tract and 25% in the lungs, you know. So carcinoid tumors uh, can occur almost uh, anywhere in the gastrointestinal tract, uh, uh, but primarily in uh, the stomach, small intestine, appendix, colon, and rectum. You know. Now the uh, carcinoid tumors uh, uh, can be benign uh, or malignant. So benign means uh, non-cancerous, and malignant means cancerous. You know. So even when they are malignant, carcinoid tumors usually are slow to grow and uh, to spread. You know. So the carcinoid tumors uh, or the carcinoid syndrome uh, is a syndrome that is caused by the release of hormones and other chemical substances called um, uh, vasoactive uh, amines, you know, from the uh, carcinoid tumor, you know. Now the carcinoid syndrome uh, may include the signs and symptoms like uh, uh, abdominal pain wheezing, uh, facial flushing and uh, diarrhea and the others may be the, uh, you know, the heart diseases and uh, uh, carcinoid crisis, you know. So the carcinoid tumor uh, uh, can be found by endoscopy, uh, by small intestinal x-ray studies and capsule endoscopy, you know. Now the diagnosis uh, uh, requires the biopsy to provide uh, a tissue sample, you know. Uh, so the metastatic uh, carcinoid tumors can be uh, diagnosed by the CT scan or MRI scans, you know, or uh, in the M111, uh, uh, you know, uh, uh, octreotide scans, you know, and uh, bone scans as well, you know. So uh, carcinoid tumors can be managed and treated with observation, um, surgery, or cryotherapy, you know. Uh, and radiofrequency ablation as well, you know, so hepatic artery embolization, you know, and uh, uh, interferon therapy. Uh, chemotherapy and radiation therapy are the options too. So the uh, carcinoid syndrome signs or symptoms can be blocked and lessened by medication, you know. Now the uh, prognosis uh, uh, and survival rate for uh, uh, someone with the carcinoid tumor varies uh, with the extent of the a metastatic disease uh, in the presence of the uh, carcinoid uh, syndrome, you know. So the clinical course of these uh, cancers is often um, indolent uh, with uh, five years survival approaching, you know, 75 percent or you know. So the current treatment uh, is not uh, curative, uh, but patients uh, can be helped by uh, palliative measures, you know. So there was uh, all about uh, uh, carcinoid syndrome. Thank you very much for watching this video and uh, uh, keep watching and please do not forget to subscribe to this channel to support us. Thank you very much.